an extraterrestrial craft not from these parts, now lost in a hostile, barren, lonely landscape, Reading. The Horizon was launched by Queen Mary's Grammar School in Walsall on the 9th of February, a cuboid polystyrene craft taking photos from the outer atmosphere when it entered Hampshire. The students were following Horizon in their minibus, tracking it with a combination of GPS and short radio waves. And as they went through Old Basing, about 3,000 feet above ground level, they lost signal. After a search proved fruitless, the SIM card on board flickered to life and led the team to Reading. The last gasp of signal came from this car park at the rear of some offices in Talhurst and it's thought that the balloon either ended up in the boot of someone's car and they drove off or even worse, it ended up in this bin and was taken away to landfill. Walsall, we have a problem. Luckily, there was a solution on the doorstep. Tilehurst resident Patricia Roth heard about the children's plight and has been rallying the troops. They were very excited, actually. There's a little boy who immediately had to go into his back garden to have a good look. It's just about a four-year-old, so... Yes, I think it's a case of getting everybody aware. Ground control. Horizon is in good company. There have been many ventures into space that have become mislaid. Voyager 1 went to study Jupiter in 1977 and last year passed beyond the edge of the solar system. The British probe Beagle 2 was sent to Mars in 2003. All contact was lost six days before it entered the atmosphere. And the students behind Horizon stand to lose just as much. We've got a year's worth of work ploughed into this, so um, there's a tremendous amount of effort and sweat, but ultimately what we want back is the photography. These were very unique photographs. This is the first time the school has ever run a project like this, and they were taken at 34 kilometres above the Earth's surface, so it's going to be some quite stunning photography to come back. The students hope their satellite will re-enter their orbit soon. Ben Moore, BBC South Today, Reading.